Hello, everybody. Good day to you all. I have. I hope you have. You all have a great Saturday, at least at the beginning of it. So I'll be waiting for confirmation and comments. If you can hear me, if you can see the screen. Uh, also, I want to let you know up front that the quality of the video itself may be not that well. I mean. I think it could be somewhere around 720 also, or even 1080, uh, but we decreased the quality of the video uh, to, to decrease all delays uh, that can be caused by YouTube. Uh, so keep in mind that. I'll also write in the comments right now the website where you can find the web application of the game so you don't need to download it. <clears throat> Sorry, I got a bit sick these days. But I hope it won't cause troubles for you. This is the website I just sent into to the chat uh, where you can play the game directly without downloading anything. Uh, you will need to enter the bin there, which you will see on our screen. Uh, yeah, something like that. Uh, so uh, we'll start with uh, with choosing our winners for uh, retweets. Thank you all. Uh, it was really lots of uh, retweets. Uh, you shared it really hard. Uh, thank you. Thank you all again. Uh, so if you have a take a up, it's also fine. <laughs> That's great. Uh, it doesn't matter to you. I'm just saying that because uh, if somebody doesn't have an app, he doesn't need to download that. But you can play it both in the app and uh, with the web application. So uh, I think we can start uh, with our just uh, with our retweet prizes. I prepared a small table for you so you can see here all mentions that you've done during this week. I even added the latest one that were just minutes before the broadcast. So as you can see here, we have 54, uh, 54 mentions. Uh, as always, we use random org to see uh, who's gonna win. So I think we can start right now. Yes, it's already nine of us, if I'm not wrong. <clears throat> let's give some more time for people to join. Uh, so let's see, number 17 takes the first prize. I'll contact you all later uh, after the broadcast and send you the gift codes for $50. Uh, let's go for one more. 30. Okay. And last but not least. So these three people will receive a gift code from us for uh, $50. Uh, thank you everybody for, uh, for your support. It's really valuable for us. We appreciate that a lot. Uh, if you like this, uh, this Kahoot quiz from us, I think that we can uh, continue in this direction doing some more if we we'll have uh, enough support for you. But for now, like it's amazing. Thank you, guys. So uh, on the screen, you can see uh, the game pin, which you should enter into your app or on the website I've mentioned. Uh, this game will be a uh, testing one. We will test. I'll show you the kind of questions that you will have uh, on our during our main quiz. Uh, and uh, uh, yeah, so uh, this is basically the test one. Uh, we'll test how it works for you, and then we'll move move on to our main one. So let's wait until you join the game. Uh, 
are there any troubles with the broadcast you cannot see or what's happening or you just don't want to play with us uh i'm on the app should i join as students or social etc uh it's uh actually uh doesn't matter you don't even have to sign up to kahoot you just need to enter the game pin uh you don't need an account there to play you just create uh you just set your nickname just before entering the 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 exact game in this case ours so i mean also but uh, as you can see okay i see already nine players joint okay that's great so i uh, think yes uh, we have nine viewers so let's start uh, with this again this is going to be a test one with very simple questions just to show you how uh, this one's gonna work so i see you all use the correct way uh yes of typing in your nicknames so okay uh let's start uh, so you'll have four kinds of questions. Uh, first one is where you have choose one out of four correct answers. So this is the question, who is considered the creator of Bitcoin? You'll have, you see four, uh, four options on, on your screen and also have four options, uh, on your, uh, second device where you have, uh, basically the ability to give answers. You need to choose the, uh, the answer you consider right, and then we'll move on. Uh, also keep in mind that uh, you can get up to 1000 points for one question. And uh, if you answer quickly, let's say it's gonna be the very first second of, uh, of the round, you'll get closer to 1000, let's say it's going to be 1000 points. And if you answer in the, in the very last second, it's going to be five, 500. So it also matters how fast you answer. So now I see, okay, it was not CIA, but yes, it uh, was Satoshi Nakamoto, but uh, let's see, now, now we're just checking, just checking if everybody, and so here you see even the people who answered correctly, the amount of points they receive is different because it depends on how fast you answer, you give answers. So the second type is true false. So you see the statements on top, uh, the highest price of uh, one Bitcoin was uh, $500,000. And now you need to t choose either this statement is true or false. Again, the same, faster you answer, uh, more points you get, but if you answer incorrectly, you get zero points, no matter how fast you did this. Okay, I see that somebody has troubles with internet. Uh, uh, does anybody also have any troubles with that? So, I mean, now it's not that crucial, but it wouldn't be very nice if you would lose your connection during the main game. Okay, again, we have two versus five. And this is our scoreboard, which will be updated after each question. The third type of questions is you need to type in the answer. They will be all the same questions. You need to enter the ticker of this or another uh, cryptocurrency. In our case, in our test question, it's Ethereum. So you need to enter the ticker. Let me remind you what the ticker is. For example, ticker of Bitcoin is BTC. So the ticker of Ethereum is, you need to type in right now. Uh, 
who's joining us right now this is um this is the test game so you can just see how it's going on how, how we played and uh after this we will start our main game so it's not the game for uh it's not the our our uh competition we're just testing it okay we have six answers and i think we need one more to proceed but also you can see the game pin uh, on the lower right corner at any time if for example you got kicked out for some reasons or whatever uh you see the game pin in the bottom right corner of the screen okay and the last kind of question that we'll have is a photo question on the screen you will see a logo uh, you will see the logo of the cryptocurrency and you'll have to tell to which cryptocurrency that this logo refer to but keep in mind then during the main game uh it's not going to be that easy with logos we've we made something to them so it's going to be not that easy to recognize them but still uh if you try a bit i think you can all do that very simply so i see some people have troubles with internet uh, can you tell me uh what sort of troubles do you have huge delays or you don't see the screen or you don't hear me what what kind of troubles are you having so yeah and this is uh this was uh, the right answer bitcoin obviously uh now we see our test podium who would win this so uh this kind of animation we'll get also after our uh, main game so yeah this is how it goes so we will not have uh, the situation where we have two first places or two second place no it's not gonna happen because it depends on the time how fast you answer uh okay we close this one and we open another one And do you have your friend mouse? So okay, this is our okay, that's a bit too loud. Uh, this is our main game. You can see the pin on top four seven seven two nine seven. Uh, the game will be basically the same as you had one in uh, in the test session uh the types of questions will be absolutely the same they will be a bit harder but uh don't worry if you see the question and you think that you don't know the answer just uh don't rush uh take your time a bit and uh, i think that you can find the right answer because uh, the questions are not that hard yes they're not too easy but also I think that almost everybody uh, can give correct answer. Yes, we are waiting. We are not rushing anywhere, so don't worry. We'll take a few minutes break, take a deep breath to, to have a really nice game, to enjoy it, to get some money in the end. That's why we are here, right? to have some fun and to make some money. We have seven players so far and we have 11 viewers so where are the rest four players 
Okay, I am one of the viewers because I need to check the chat all the time. Um, but uh, okay, where are the other three? Why aren't you joining, guys? Okay, I see already eight. No, again, seven. Yes, eight again. Nine. Okay, let's wait one more minute and we start. So you have 60 seconds to answer each question. So I don't think there's gonna be a problem with the, with the delays of YouTube broadcast, as, but also I'm checking, it's not that big. Uh, Uh, currently, uh, so I don't really get the last question uh, on the chat. I'm not seeing the, the question on my web screen. So uh, if you're talking about the broadcast, you'll see the question as soon as we start the game. If you're talking about your device where you answer, where you, where you give answers, you won't see them there. That's why we said that you need to have two devices. One. Uh, you need one to see the questions, to see our broadcast where we show you the questions, and the second one to give answers. You cannot give answers through the app, or you cannot give the answers through the web application of Kahoot. Uh, that's that's how they work. That's not something we control. That's just something we have to work with. I. Uh, what's what's your name on the screen? Maybe you. You need to wait, you know, like a few seconds before it appears. Because again, the YouTube broadcast has minor delays, like I think up to 10 seconds, maybe. So whatever you do on your phone, uh, for example, give answer or enter the game, you'll see that on the screen like 10 seconds later. Okay, 13, P 13 viewers now we have. Uh, I don't know, should we should we go on? Should we start or should we wait? Just uh, write something in the chat so I can understand where, where should we move. Okay. Uh, if you if you don't see your name on the screen, uh, try to leave it and rejoin again. Okay, let's wait last thirty seconds, uh, and then we kick off. Uh, Shalom, Mika. I see your uh, comment. Uh, unfortunately, that's something I cannot control. It's not something I choose or not choose. Uh, it's the type, this type of the game, and I cannot turn off the feature of uh, answering quickly. I mean, I cannot change the distribution of points. That's how it works for everybody. So, okay, uh, we shall start now. We have 10 players, three, three prizes, and let's see how will they be distributed. Okay, we have not nine, ten, nine players. Uh, did just someone decide to leave or is he rejoining? Okay, I see. So I think we should start before anybody else is living. Okay, let's 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 go. Uh, 
And we start with our first question, and I wish you all good luck. What is the name of phase zero in Ethereum 2.0? Sometimes the questions may look hard, but they are not. And if you read all the answers carefully, you can come up with something that looks as much right as possible comparing to the other, comparing to the other options. Okay, we didn't have all the answers, unfortunately. Not everybody replied. Yes, uh, two people replied correctly, four incorrectly, and where the other four? Where did they? Uh, where were they? So they didn't answer. Okay, uh, let's move to let's see our scoreboard, uh, and this how it looks now. And let's go to the second question. Date of creation of the Genesis block of the BTC. In other words, when the block number zero of Bitcoin was created, what is the birthday? Or, well, it's not really the birthday. Uh, basically, where is, when, did, uh, when did they create first block of Bitcoin? I mean, Two more answers. Who's missing? Okay, now we have them all, right? Uh, oh, still one is missing, no? Uh, so yes, it was January the 3rd, 2009. And the majority, I mean, the yeah, four people answered correctly congrats let's see our scoreboard how did it change almost didn't change at all but there are 18 more questions to go so let's let's move on where is vitalik buterin's father from uh vitalik buterin is as you may know well you have to know this uh he's the creator of ethereum one of the most influential people in the crypto world. And now you need to choose from where his father is from. Okay, I see somebody is reconnecting. We'll uh, we'll pause a bit after this question to wait until uh, everybody can join us. Unfortunately, I can cannot see the amount of players playing right now. Nobody gave the right answer. How did it happen? Uh, very sad. Very sad. Okay, but well, at least nobody gets a point, right? uh okay the scoreboard obviously doesn't change uh so we wait a few seconds uh until wendy can join us <clears throat> please wendy write in to the chat as soon as you're ready you can 
wait for you for a minute or so. Okay, I hope that you rejoined us successfully and we move on. Quiz, another one, number four. So you may remember that uh, we actually had a question on our Telegram channel about these famous pizzas. That was, was basically the first ever uh, act of purchase of something with uh, cryptocurrency. So from where did they buy these two pizzas from? Pizza Hut, Domino's, Pizza Rock, or Papa John? That's kind of, I think that's kind of an easy question because that's a pretty famous one. Again, that's that's when we all celebrate Bitcoin Pizza Day. Moreover, uh, every May, uh, Bizlato celebrates Bitcoin Pizza Day. Uh, we, we gift pizzas to all our users. Well, I'll tell you more in May. This is, yes, it was obviously Papa John, actually my favorite pizza. Their garlic sauce is amazing. Uh, okay, so this is how our scoreboard changed. Uh, and now we move to our question number five. Where did Uniswap attract their first investments from? Was it ICO, Ethereum Foundation, Uncle Was Brothers, or STO? And in case somebody lost the connection or, or was kicked out from the game, you can see in the bottom right corner, you can see, you can always find game pin to rejoin us. We have four answers so far. Five. We have late commerce seven and okay we just had seven answers for this one uh yes it was ethereum foundation i'm glad three of you answered correctly as we move on to our next question uh, oh well first we see the changes in the scoreboard and now you need to ans uh, enter the ticker uh that's something i was telling you about remember ticker of bitcoin is btc so now you need to enter the ticker of rev bitcoin again as i told you some some questions may look difficult but if you just think a bit about it you can come up with the right answer and i wish to all of you to give only right answers And that's it. We had only five answers, unfortunately. And so, yep, uh, four of them were correct. So congratulations. Yeah, it's not, it wasn't that easy, was it? Just wrap Bitcoin, you had W into the beginning, right? Okay, uh, next one. No, again, we see the scoreboard, how it changed. And then we go uh, straight, straight to the next ticker and this is ticker of tron 
also not that difficult. The coin is in top 10 of uh, coin market cap. Quite popular, so you may know that. And again, not that easy ticker. Not the difficult, I mean, not the difficult. There were some difficult ones, but we decided not to pick them. Uh, if we try rejoining, it says username already taken. So, okay, uh, you can, oh, well, it's, yeah, it's uh, not nice, but you know what you can do? You can use your nickname as you enter the first time and just add two or like just to be a bit cre creative so I could understand that it's uh, your, uh, it was your account, your nicknames, and uh, in the end we can uh, add uh, points from both accounts. Let's see what we can do. So yeah, it was TRX. TRX is the ticker of Tron. So again, to all of you, if you if you lost your connection and you need to reconnect and it says that uh, your username is already taken, just use the same username and add number two or something like that so I, so I could understand that it's your, um, uh, the previous points are yours. Now, Let's go to our question number eight. So for those who, are, who cannot see themselves on the scoreboard, uh, don't be sad, it's just question number eight. We have 12 more to go, actually 13 more. So everything can change. You need to enter the ticker of the sushi swap coin, which is also pretty easy. Not pretty, it's super easy. I think the majority of you already know about that, so... But I don't see answers. Why is that? Well, that's very, very simple. Okay, yeah, the majority answered correctly. As I told you, it's a very simple ticker for this nice coin. Oh, somebody's on fire. Um, you have the highest answer streak of three. Very nice, and congratulations. Again, to all those of you who cannot see themselves among these, our, among these leaders, don't worry. It's just, it's going to be question number nine out of 20. So enter the ticker of the Litecoin. That must be super easy to you. Especially to those who use Bitslato, as we also trade Litecoin, a lot of Litecoin P2P trading on our platform. Uh, Shalom, I see that you have problems where you're Kahoot up. I maybe try to reconnect. I don't know why that's happening. That's usually not happening with the Kahoot. I've never seen this sort of problems, to be honest. Because uh, usually people can see, let's say, question number 10 when you can see only number 9 on your screen. Yes, so uh, seven correct answers. Yes, it's 
LTC, very simple, like Bitcoin is BTC, so Litecoin is LTC. Uh, let's see how our, how our scoreboard changed. We see the, oh, there are always movements, always movements, and well, Mark Macau has the highest answer streak of four. Congratulations. We move to the next question. The last question with the tickers. Polkadot ticker. And then quite simple, if you, if you did trading or if you, if you just follow different coins, Quite easy ticker for this coin. Three letters. That's it. Yes, we all are answering question number 10 right now. Again, seven people answered correctly. It's DOT dot. Mark Macau is not going to lose today, is he? Fifth correct answer. Congratulations. Uh, now it's true or false question. Uh, you see the statement. You see the statement, you need to say if it's true or false. Uh, I see, Shalom, you say you are discouraged. Why? Why is that happening? It's We're just in the middle of our game, so anything can change right now. Moreover, just also consider this game as we're having fun today, right? And also it's sort of education. So next time, or maybe we'll also use uh, some of these questions on our Telegram channel. So it's better to remember those answers. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I see if the answers were divided. Yeah, you wouldn't expect that that creator would say about his token, something like that, but that's what we can see. So you say mine is 11. Uh, yes, we just we just answered question number 11 right now. You can see them in the bottom left corner. What's the questions right now? It's 11 out of 20. Next one will be 12. And we see first our scoreboard. Okay, now Murat Mary is trying to reach Mark. There's gonna be interesting battle by the end. Oh. Uh, you see how the how it changes all the time the scoreboard. So don't get discouraged. In any case, firstly it's just a game. Secondly, you don't know where you in this top, and the difference is just a matter of two questions. It says time up on my side, and it's not over. Uh, I don't really understand what's, what's not over. Because if you see on the screen that it's not over, that means because uh, you can see that because YouTube broadcast has a delay like around uh, five seconds. I also checked that on my phone while streaming this. And the difference, the delay is like around from five to 10 seconds. So it may happen that on your phone, phone your phone works faster than what you see on, uh, on the screen. Of, of YouTube. 
And we go to the question number 12. The same true or false Uniswap or to Coinbase and trading volume. Did they or, or didn't? Yes, correctly. It's question number 12 right now. So we have 10 answers already, so I think that's all, is it? Almost everybody answered correctly. Very nice. Congratulations to almost all of you. And our scoreboard didn't change in terms of leaders, but changed in terms of points. And Roth is also on a streak right now with five correct answers. Well, I'm very curious how it's gonna end up eight more questions to go not that big like it's very small difference in terms of points just a matter of few wrong questions and the last questions to be honest will be the most difficult remember those ones with pictures yeah let's see okay uh another one true or false question dpos stands for dynamic proof of stake is it true or is it false who can tell me Let me remind you, if you answer fast and correctly, you get most points. If you answer slow, but still correctly, you get half of possible points. And if you answer incorrectly, no matter fast or slow, it's still going to be zero points. So if you're sure in something, if you know this, don't waste your time, click on the button you think is right that's how you can chase and reach the top three or in case if you're in the top three you won't let anybody to to chase you so yes it's false it's not dynamic proof of stake obviously uh we have seven people uh, answering correctly three people answering wrong maybe they're from top three or not let's see well you see the top three has changed as i told you anything can change in our game the difference between point between place number three and place number one is just uh 1500 points which is one question and a half and Raz has a streak of six correct answers in a row right now Getting tight. The Winklevoss brothers are called Cameron and Arthur. True or false? No fast answer is really, I, I expected this one will be answered very fast. And only one correct answer. Seriously, you were thinking for so long and you all gave the wrong answer. So 
Now let's see who is joining our, if somebody is joining our leaderboard. Oh, it was only Mark who answered correctly. So he used this question to go in further. Well done, Mark. And I'm really surprised that everybody answered incorrectly except for Mark. Okay, let's move forward. The third Bitcoin halving took place on block number 630000, or it's, it's not uh, 630,000. We shall be, we shall be more correct. I feel like somebody is check, double checking himself on Google. But the last five questions will really show who is, who is the guru of crypto, who knows everything, and who's just Googling stuff. Because the last questions you cannot Google, fortunately. Or unfortunately, let's see. So the last five questions will make the difference, the real difference. Uh, third Bitcoin halving did took place on this block. And there is always somebody missing. Somebody's not answering uh, all the questions. I always see it's like nine answers while we have 10 people playing. Uh, Uh, something's not okay. Some of our apps is ahead of us. Uh, ahead. No, no, it's not possible because all the apps are work uh, at the same moment as as my game. And five from five to ten seconds later, you will see the same on your screen on YouTube. Someone may, may see. Uh, it may. It may take a bit more time to see because it also depends on internet connection and different stuff but the game the app works at the same time for everybody so now we go to our photo questions uh the pictures you will okay first let's see the scoreboard and it almost didn't change uh basically didn't change just the points uh so the next uh, questions you'll see the distorted picture of uh actually see the distorted logo of uh some of coins and you need to tell to which coins do they refer to and we start right now so you see the picture is a bit distorted but you can still understand uh what coin is that? Five last questions. It's your chance, guys, to change the game and to become the leader of the scoreboard getting the price of $200 for the first place, $150 for second, and $100 for third one. That's how they say in boxing, the champions rounds. Again, just one person didn't reply. Uh, yes, the majority answered correctly, and I'm really happy with that. It's Cardano. And let's see the scoreboard if it's changed. Uh, yes, again, we see the points change. Mark just goes goes forward. Uh, but there is still quite a chance to, to chase places number two and three. Let's see what's going to go. How it will go, I mean. <laughs> Uh, what's the cryptocurrency that this logo referred to?
15 seconds to go. Four more questions. Four more, I mean, four more answers to be given. Okay, maybe just person number 10 is not playing with us anymore. Uh, yes, it is Binance USD. Also quite easy to recognize, is it? And we see new person on the leaderboard. Let's go. Yes, questions are faster on your app. That's true. That's what I'm saying, because uh, YouTube broadcast has minor delays and you, uh, yeah, firstly, you see this on your app because it's connected to my laptop where I opened the game. And what you see on, uh, on the screen on YouTube, it's uh, from five to 10 seconds later. That's the downsides of broadcast. Yeah, here we can see the right answer. Uh, only two people answered correctly. And we go to the to our two last questions. Question number nineteen. Uh, before that, we obviously okay. Mark, Mark goes really fast. I, oh, this is <laughs> I would bet that it's our this is our winner of today because the difference already in two questions and only if he will reply incorrectly and Murath will answer two next questions correctly and very fast he can get first place so let's see yeah not that easy or easy let's see how fast your answers will come Yeah, pretty fast, pretty fast. Is it? Is it Mark and Murath are challenging each other or somebody else? New or no, I rather knows uh, to what currency does this logo refer to? 20 seconds left. Yes, very nice, uh, it was um, four people answered correctly and I'm really happy with that. Okay, so the last question will be really interesting one. You see the scoreboard is really tight. I mean, yeah, Mark, congratulations with your victory. Uh, nobody can can challenge you anymore but we still we can still see the fight for places number two and place uh, like second and third places and there are at least four contenders for those maybe more because i don't see uh the scoreboard lower fifth place so maybe you're also in in, in the race let's see don't give up guys this is your chance to win so let's go for the last question
last log. Okay, so we have an answer already. Maybe that's one of the chasers. Two answers. Um, this is a very tight game. I'm very curious what will happen in the end. But also, not everybody is Russian. Not everybody is Russian. Because again, if you answer wrong, you get zero points. If you answer correctly but slow, you get 500 points. And the majority answered correctly. Wow, that was that was really nice game. I uh, thank you all for joining. And well, I think it's time to go to our the to our our the most interesting part with our winners. Let's see our podium. So, shall we begin? And this is our podium. Uh, you can see also runners up. Uh, one small note. So as you can see on the third place, we have Reginald, our employee. And well, I think that wouldn't be really fair if we would give the prizes to our employees. So we will uh, substitute him with the person who took place number four uh, i think that was uh, st joseph if i'm not wrong but i'll check it in the list so again uh, congratulations to all the winners uh thank you to everybody who took part uh uh thank you for uh, everybody who took part in this game uh i hope it was fun for you uh i really expect you to write your feedback on twitter uh, so we could see what we can improve what we can do better uh, what we can do more interesting for you and if we'll have enough if we see enough feedback from you if you see that uh, you want this to continue these quizzes we will definitely continue doing so, so and uh, maybe even do one more um, very soon why not so yeah we'll be expecting a feedback from you on twitter uh mention our uh account bizlato africa uh we'll read everything absolutely and uh, thank you again and now let me uh let me read the chat what you're writing here right now Uh, so any gifts for top of all? Uh, unfortunately, we uh, have only three, three uh, places uh, for prizes, and well, in this case, we have kind of four. Okay, thank you, everybody. Uh, thank you for your kind words again. Uh, share your uh, share your experience on Twitter. Uh, share what you think. Mention us, and well, maybe we will, we can ever reward some the most interesting uh, feedbacks, uh, the most valuable for us. Uh, let's see what we can do. So thank you again, and see you see you soon. See you soon. Yeah. Yeah, guys. Uh, have a great weekend. Goodbye. Okay,